Welcome to Woggle Guides. In this guide, I'll show you how to add a new folder or subfolder to Gmail. Let's get straight into it. Whilst in other email tools, such as Outlook, emails can only be moved to a single folder, in Gmail, emails can be assigned to multiple labels. You can use labels exactly like a folder, however. Let me show you now how to create a new label and store emails in it. I'm logged into Google and I'm in my Gmail inbox. You can see your Gmail labels or folders in the left hand panel of the inbox view. Depending on how many labels you currently have, the link to create a new label may be hidden. To display that, let's click on the More link at the bottom of the folder list. And you'll see at the bottom of this list is a new option to create new label. Let's click on that now. A box appears that asks you to enter the name of the new folder or label you want to add. Let's type that in. This will create a top level folder in the list shown on the left of the inbox. And to confirm that, I'll click on the large blue create button. This new folder is then added to the list. It's just as easy to create a subfolder. If I click back into the create new label box and give my subfolder a name, I can then add it underneath any existing folder by clicking on the option that says nest label under. Gmail then displays a drop down that allows you to choose which existing folder to add this new folder underneath. I'll choose the top level folder I've just created called folder. To confirm that, let's click on the large blue create button again. And you can see that the new subfolder has been added below the folder we created in the list. Just like in Outlook, I can now drag emails to the folders I've just created. And if I click into that folder, you'll see that the emails added are displayed. Check out the Woggle Guide shown above if you want to find out how you can set up rules to automatically add emails to folders. I hope you find this Woggle Guide useful and learned something new. If you have, please like or subscribe so that other users can find it too. Thanks for watching.